Hello, I'm Richard Bate and I'm a specialist personal injury solicitor. I set up Richardson's and Co Solicitors, the injury solicitors, to ensure that all clients can receive the maximum compensation that they're entitled to. Thank you for watching this video. I'm here to help you today to understand for what in English law can you make a claim for compensation. Compensation in England and Wales is received by you in two ways but that comes together to form one single award of compensation. Legally for me they're known as general damages and special damages. The general damages are probably the reason that you're watching this video today and quite simply that's to obtain compensation that you deserve for the personal injuries you've suffered. The compensation awarded to you for your personal injuries takes into account the type of injury that you have actually suffered, the severity of those symptoms that you've had, the overall impact and effect that the injuries have had upon your life and how long that you actually suffer from those injuries for. So as you can see, each case is taken on its own merits and takes into account your individual circumstances. To go, along, go alongside with your personal injury compensation, you are also entitled to claim for financial losses that you incur as a direct result of the accident and of course those injuries that you sustained. And this can be anything from having your damaged vehicle replaced, if it has to be written off and you need to buy a new car, or if you can have that car repaired. Whilst that car's off the road, you may need a replacement vehicle. That's the higher cost. You can also receive compensation for the cost of having your family members and friends take care of you and look after you when had you not had this accident and been injured, you wouldn't have needed their help previously. Financial losses can include an awful lot of things, but an important one is loss of earnings from being absent from work as a result of your injuries, to the travel expenses you may incur attending your medical appointments at the hospital or physiotherapy. You may have damaged your clothing in the accident and again you can claim for the replacement of those clothes. This is not an exhaustive list for you, each case is different and is taken on its own merits. But this does give you, I hope, a general idea as to what you can realistically make a claim for legally in the UK. With regards to any financial losses, always obtain and keep a receipt outlining the cost because that does make it easier to recover those losses from your opponent. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you have any further questions, please feel free to contact us. We're always happy to speak to you. Please feel free to visit our website, www.theinjurysolicitors.net. Thank you for watching.